What is going on YouTube? It is the fall. I am bringing you part two drum fishing adventures in Outer Banks. This video is of our third total trip out to the Outer Banks this fall. I know some of y'all are wondering Zach, what happened with all the last video. Had the fish on. What happened? Didn't even make an outro to that video because I was just so damn disappointed in myself. God gave me one chance and I blew it. After examining the line, the line was just had little nicks every five feet or so all on the main line. And I guess, you know, at the end of the day, the fish got off because of a, uh, a kink or a nick in my line. The fish found a found a wink point in my line and it's out there swimming off somewhere. Somebody else's trophy. Hopefully somebody's got a picture of it, but it isn't me. So at the end of the day, I lost that fish because of the line. Really my error and I suck at fishing, but we all know that. Moving on. But that's what fishing is. You know, you go through experiences, you live, you learn, and you keep fishing. And in this case, what I learned was to check my line every time, which I should have done. I normally always do it, but I guess I was just feeling lazy. Really wasn't checking the line how I was supposed to that day and I paid for it. After three and a half hours of driving on the Outer Banks, good four hours of Ryan and I breaking our backs trying to catch bait with the cast net. That cast net is big, man. That that thing weighs. Anyway, my back was broken, hurting. I didn't even really feel like fishing after that. After we did all that, we went fishing. Are you gonna say anything or you're just gonna stare? Oh, I'm on video, yeah. <laughs> I just caught the shark that I just lost on the same rig or on the net on a different rig, greedy ass fish. Sharks, 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 sharks. Well, I mean apparently I can teach y'all how to catch sharks. Not so much with those drum, huh? It's one of those things when you go, you know, making a trip that far, you really want to plan ahead. Look at the forecast, see what the winds are doing and the conditions. Cause I mean, that whole trip, we were there for a couple days. And I mean, there was only one caught from the pier. Not, and obviously it wasn't from us, but there was only one caught. It was a good fish. This trip was actually, well, my birthday actually fell within the dates of this trip. Are you fishing? Yeah, about to. Okay, well, just don't fall in, okay? We love you. Love you guys. Trust me, before I went on the trip, had a little birthday cake, blew out the candles, and I promise you, I wished for a drum. Didn't happen. I mean, it was a, it was a good, it was a good fun trip, you know, outside of not catching any fish. We met some new friends out there on the pier. <laughs> We gave Ryan a new nickname. Since yesterday, his name was uh, Mustard because he ordered, got about eight hot dogs and he put one strip of mustard on each and every one of them. <laughs> I mean, I guess we apparently witnessed some sort of an ass whooping. Yeah, check out, check out my uh, Instagram and Follow me on Fish Brain. Kind of keep stuff up to date. Kind of let y'all know on Instagram, especially when I'm making trips and stuff and where I'm going. Give this video a like. Go ahead, put a comment in there in the comment section. Let me know if y'all think I'm going to get a drum this year. Or if you think Ryan's going to get a drum this year. Let us know if you think both of us or none of us are going to get a drum this year. Please check out my other videos I got up. Hit that subscribe button. See what kind of fish I'm catching and not catching. All right, guys. Choppers, 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 choppers. From the top to the bottom.